to No Place Like Home. And today we're going to have some fun, fun, fun. We're going to design our own wall mirror. Stay tuned. I'm going to show you just how to do it. Okay. First of all, what we're going to do, we're going to make our own fake glass. Okay. You will need a, a cereal box. Uh, it's some fall. So first of all, what we're going to do, I already have cut this out. So we're going to go ahead. I got a, a little penny here. And we need about 36 of these. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and just draw out each one of these. Okay, so I am finishing up on covering my my little silver plates. So I'm gonna show y'all how I'm doing this. I got just a few more left, so I'm gonna just go ahead and show y'all how to do it. You just kind of just place it like so. And then you will kind of just wrap it around it. Okay, so next, we're going to do our little tubes. And I have already did just about all of them, but I'm gonna do about five more just for demonstration. Because these take a little longer to do. And I already have cut them. And they're about 12 inches by, 12 to 14 inches by three inches in width. Okay. So we're gonna get started. I'm gonna show y'all how to do this. Okay, we're just gonna kind of catch it right, right here on the side, just like so. And you probably did this when you was in school. I don't know. I kind of remember doing this when I was in school. You're gonna kind of catch the end of it like so, and you're gonna kind of roll it with this little stick here. And you're just gonna keep it rolling. And try to have it as tight as possible. Look at something. And I got my little ammo glue. And you just go ahead and put a little glue on it. And they're just just to tighten it down so until you can go to your next step and that's all to it and then you're gonna go ahead and just pull your little stick out and you're gonna do your next one went on and painted these with, with my mud pie I want to make sure they won't unravel when I get ready to cut them so what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna let them dry a little bit and then I'm gonna take them outside and I'm gonna spray paint with my silver spray paint. Okay, so I have let it dry and I've spray painted it silver. And you can see the line from the top one all the way down to the bottom. I'm gonna have it kind of like a triangle. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'll be back and I'm gonna cut along each one of those tubes until I get down to the end. All the way up to the top here. And now I am about to, I'm gonna set this aside. This is what we're gonna place our little tubes on. And then this is a five inch circle. In the middle, I have a two inch in the middle. So I'm gonna make 36 little lines all the way around because I have 36 of these little tubes that I'm going to place on this little circle here.
we have gotten all these on. It's a little time consuming. But that's what we got. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna pop a little tear on. circle song. Okay, we got all the circles and everything on. So we're going to put our mirror on. So we got one more thing to do. Okay, I'm going to use a little um, clip. I'm going to put through here. This is where we're going to hang it. another one over here to give it balance. Okay, I think we are done. Oh, okay, so this is the final results of our project today. I think we've done a great job. Please try this at home. You can use this like in your bedroom. I have it in my bedroom. Or you can just put it in your bathroom or your living room or just anywhere you want us to have some bling bling. Okay, I enjoy being with y'all today and each and every day y'all have a blessed and safe day. Okay, see y'all the next time for the next project. Okay, bye-bye.